well this is going to be one of my next projects my wife has a candle company and she makes soy based candles and a variety of vessels and she wanted a mobile showroom she's been doing farmers markets for a while and we are in central texas and of course fighting the heat during the summer is a real challenge i'm going to put a link to her website in there you can check out some of her work she makes some really cool stuff but anyway what she wanted was some kind of mobile showroom to go to these farmers markets she's currently been setting up with a tent and tables and again just having to fight the heat finding power to put up fans just to keep the heat away so we found a 2001 chevy van short bus and it had already been converted quite a bit it originally was just used to transport people in the petroleum industry and one of the key features that attracted us is nice when things are already done number one it's got a big roof ac your typical rv type roof ac and then the other thing is it's got a brand new 3500 generator in here already set up ready to go the powers a panel on the inside so it's got power and it's got air conditioning already to start off with so let's go take a look inside there she is the driving area on this little school bus it's in really good shape like I said it's an 01 and the previous owners had just done a bunch of maintenance on it so that parts in good shape and they had gutted it the purpose of this for them was to be a mobile margarita and daiquiri company they chose to get out of that wanted to do something else so they're selling the bus we picked it up over in East Texas and brought it home first thing is we wanted to try to help mitigate some of the heat we're already dealing with it's June right now so the first thing we did was blacked out the windows and put up some foam type insulation it's that foil line foam core that's just a base layer you can already feel during the day just a reduction of heat by taking out the light she doesn't need sunlight in here artificial light is fine and there's already a little bit of sunlight from the back anyway so right now what she's doing is a table setup with um, like she did with the tents before we'll have tables in here slider racks to put out all of her candles and eventually it's going to be a storefront if you will i'm going to build out some shelving for her for display racks on one side these dough bowls that she used will kind of sit out on larger tables probably on this side i'm going to weld up some aluminum racks for her there'll be little slider racks for four ounce and eight ounce candle jars that she has and then she can keep a mobile inventory without having to unload and reload when she gets home because there's the air conditioner here at the back hooked to a 120 volt panel essentially a shoreline as soon as she gets home she unplugs it plugs the shoreline into the wall power and this thing will stay cool 24 7 so no more ruining product and no more having to load and offload she can fire it up head down the road set up camp and start her store first order of business now that we kind of have a cool on the inside is we're going to rip all of this out and put in some type of laminate looking flooring just something to make it one solid floor and then the next step is going to be to start working on the display shelving and storage so for now this is where the bus stands it's already mobile ready to go and it's going to be a whole lot cooler when she goes through her next farmer's market this week Stay tuned. I'll be posting some more updates on the work as we progress through this little bus. Thanks for stopping, and I'd love it if you'd like or subscribe. If you have any questions or comments about what you think we should do with it, please leave it below in the comments section. Have a great day.